Of course, we've been in this industry for over 30 years. I, when we first entered, you were speaking about uh, values for the next generation. And I just recall that if I look at people, like I said, I do a little IT, we do data recovery, we do infrastructure development, we do consulting for companies every day in Lagos. A few banks will also do some stuff for them. And I noticed if I could begin to count now, I must have trained over 30, 35, 40 people that are into IT now and they do very well on their own. Some were not even too educated, some diploma and all that. Age. We impacted people and all that. And I, I'm also privileged to be, I'm a preacher as well, anyway. And uh, everywhere I find myself, I do my best to talk about value system. Recently, we were talking about if you're going to employ guys now, what they want to talk about is how much are you going to give me? Some don't have anything to offer. Some don't have any experience to deliver. And they hope for one company to the other. Three, four months, they are done with you, looking for the next job to take. Mm -hmm. And no value to be added. They are not passionate about what you are doing. All they want is just, how much are you paying me? Incidentally, I have a younger son. I have a son that's just been for Seaways. You know Seaways now? Mm -hmm. This is for, uh, what's it called? Like Seaways. Internship. Just internship. Thank you, man. And he was like, Daddy could you talk to so 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 person for me so they could pay me some good money. So I could buy. <laughs> Just going to 300 level university students so that we buy a bigger phone. Now my thinking is how all of our life is buying a bigger phone, wear designer clothes. And so anyway, I find myself talking about this younger. I'm using my phone is Android phone. <laughs> and it doesn't even bother me about using Android phone, whatever. You almost go about adding value. Tell these people that this generation must not be based on. What's the latest thing happening now? What can I also do? My friend must not outshine me. And nobody wants to talk about what can I bring to the table? Mm -hmm. Like, that's another level. You know, that's from the day. So, whenever you find ourselves, I do so myself. Whenever we find ourselves, we must talk to people, the younger ones coming behind us. That mm -hmm. It's not about what you have now. Develop yourself. Develop capacity. That you can market the time in life. Mm -hmm. There must be value. Value is different. Other things, people chase money. Now look at the people that we talk about now. The owner of Amazon, the Facebook guy, they were not chasing money. Even the guy that said Yahoo was not chasing money. They were all allowed to have value to their world. So money is a bad product for the value you've gotten within you. And it will just come naturally. So we must tell people that don't lay emphasis on what I can get now? What can I get now? And somebody said, I'm sorry, I'm not taking much of time. I'm a teacher, I said so. Some said things are hard. Choose your hard. Choose your hard either to work now, develop yourself, and make money later. We want to chase the shadows and the fantasies that people are chasing. So whenever we find ourselves talking to everybody now, let's take our time and speak to people within our influence, within our circle of influence, and let them learn the lessons that we've taken time to learn. Once they have value to deliver, other things will follow them. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for tuning in to Nigeria Magazine's YouTube channel. Stay connected, stay informed, and stay inspired with the latest from Nigeria. Remember to like, subscribe, and ring the notification bell to stay updated.